shot. So if yeah. you go into the rough, it's an extra stroke. No, no, no! no. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Welcome back to another good, good video. Today, we're here in Branson. Again, Big Cedar Lodge out of Payne's Valley with another episode, episode, I believe, number 14 of the Good Good Cup. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the Good Good Cup. If you don't know what it is, basically we play all of our various challenges throughout these nine days, I think it is. We sign a point system to each challenge. By the end of it all, if you have the most points, you win the Good Good Cup. I'm gonna give you guys the current standings, then we're gonna get into the rules of this challenge. Quan is currently in first place with 1,685 points. Grant is in second, 1,540. Damn. Matt is in third, 1,150. Bubby is in fourth, 1,000. I'm in fifth, 995. Steven bringing it up the rear, 880. And we're on to rough as lava, one V1, 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 V1. The point system is, if you get first place, 240 points. If you get second, <laughs> 190. You get third, 130. Fourth, 80. And fifth, 66, 20. And can you explain the rules for someone like me who has no idea what's going on? Yeah, yeah. You, okay, so if yeah. you go into the rough, it's an extra stroke. And you can you you can go in the rough as many times as you want. What about bunkers? Hole. Bunkers is a stroke as well. Okay. That's a, that's wow. something that we're also doing since these fairways are massive. We're also adding the bunkers as a stroke. Four hole stroke play. Four hole stroke play. We're actually playing the white tees on this hole simply because it makes this hole 10 times more difficult. You can now reach every single bunker out here. There's rough way left and there's obviously rough way right. So it's just gonna make this hole challenging. I'm pretty sure for the rest of the holes we'll be playing the Tiger Tees. Shout out to Big Cedar Lodge for having us out here. This place is absolutely stunning. All of us are wearing that beautiful good good apparel. We've got the flowers, look at this. We've got the checkered flag. We've got some old stuff here with some new joggers. All right, boys, let's flip a tee and see what the order is here. Oh, Y'all know the no, rules. Bunkers no, 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 and no. rough, bad, bad. I don't go first. Lose first. Hit the quan. Quan, hit it in a bunker every shot, please. Garrett. Garrett. Uh, I like, no, first we'll doesn't be even right. matter because you just switch around afterwards. Matt. Short. Grant. Yeah. After that. I know I'm Me. hitting every freaking <laughs> <line>. <laughs> that is it. I flipped that tee like Grant. Dude, so, I know I'm hitting in every bunker today. I can today. technically just hit like a little iron out there, right? Yeah, yeah but you still have to, it's stroke rule. still. You have right? to drive around every hole, including par threes. That's actually your rule. <laughs> All right, here we go. The first hole is a 315 yard par four up the hill. I don't think it's drivable, but people are gonna give it a rip. We'll see what they go. We'll see where they go. Would like to not start out the hole with a penalty? We would though, Quan, so you'll be all right. I like I'll how go. negative Quan is. I'm literally looking right at that bunker, so. Please hit it in it, Quan. Please. Quan's gonna try to purposely do it and then be in the center of the fairway. Like <laughs> oh god. Oh, oh that's rough. No. I swear, if he hits a rock and kicks into the hole. I have no idea. Probably a bunker. That might be OB. I just feel like I'm going in the bunker, boys. Is that one? Oh. He no. talked him no. into the rough, that's maybe? Rough. No. No, no, no. No, okay. no, no, no! Oh! So he's hitting his third shot now. That's right, Garrett. Yeah. Dude, Grant. Dude, Garrett has not had the week. No, that was unlucky. First unlucky thing he's ever done. <laughs> nice. Okay, now is that enough? Please stay left of the bunker! I don't think he's driving Oh. Dude, we all have had a stroke. He, he went in the bunker. He went in the bunker. What the frick? Well, that was such a good drive. We've all had a stroke so far, so let's see if I can uh, not Grant, do that. Get a stroke now, Grant. It's the biggest uh -oh. freaking fairway, and I freaking uh -oh. missed it. Where's he going? Good. Where's he going? Right. He good. Oh, that's fine. He's just over. It's my little bunt driver. <laughs> what the heck is this thing on the tee box? <laughs> Get the rock. Get the rock. Get the rock. Get the rock. Oh! 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 Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Yes! No way! What is that? It's the biggest thing. No. Same as Steve! No. What's it gonna do? No, no, no. 
Carpet. Oh no. Is that a rock? Here I am guys, I'm a foot and a half into the rough, it is what it is, it happens. I gotta get this up and down for par now. Hitting my third shot, this has been the definition of my week so far, just not great. All right, we got a putt. Night, 52 yards. Colin, Matic, please. Shot. Oh, it Spin. Long, you're good. You're yeah. 65 yards here, guys. Gonna hit a 60 degree. I gotta, like, I gotta remember right now. It's still stroke play. It's still, you gotta count everything. I gotta, I'm just so focused on hitting the fairway that I'm forgetting about. We have to actually play some golf here so here we go 65 I don't know if Garrett's being serious but all right y'all we thought I might have stayed on the car path that you said at the beginning is not a stroke but I'm here technically hitting my third shot I'm gonna try that new tactic they taught me about around the greens with the putter grip feels good let's see how that works Actually, listen, amateur golfers out there, the amount of confidence I have gained in literally less than five minutes by using my putter grip like this on those shots is unreal. I it felt worked. good over that. I mean, so instead of a normal golf grip, Luke and Garrett showed me to use this around the greens with the yardage as you're comfortable. And it honestly feels good. It feels like you can guide it. it feels really good. All right, Colin. I legitimately could go uh, bunker to bunker here. I'm in a bunker. There's a bunker in front of me, and I have literally the hardest shot in golf. It's 48 yards. Uh, I don't even know what to do here. I, I thought about picking it, but that's more than likely just leaving it in this bunker or that one. So we're going to go with the gap wedge here and try to hit something out on the green somewhere. Nice shot. What? All right. Wow. I don't even know where that is. I, it's on the green, though, I think. It sucks that this is now a stroke, so i got to get up and down for par, technically, because um, I'll be putting for birdie which will be a stroke putting for par. Nice shot, man. All right, Collie Bear, up the hill, a little left to right. I need this to go in for par. <laughs> See if we can knock it in, come on. Whoa. All right, Colin, this putt is for my natural birdie, but in this game it is 4-4. I walked it off, it is just over 36 feet, so this would be for the five bonus points. I made a bonus point putt earlier this week on this hole. Let's see if we can do it again. A little left to right. I left that shorter than Garrett. Nope. Really? All right, Luis. We got an uphill putt right to left. I don't know why their putts were so slow, but I guess mine's going to be even slower. So let's try to make this and make up for that stroke that I got for hitting in the mucker. Nice putt, Luke. What, a what is going on? This man just what? saved his par and he got an extra soak. So that he made a birdie, but since he went in the bunker, he made a par. Well, boys. Dude, everybody's left it's still short. short. Here we go. I gotta make this. This is for a real birdie. A natural occurring birdie. Thank you. Let's go. We're one under now. All right, y'all. I got a good read off Madden Steve's. I see it snaps a little bit. Let's just put a good, good roll on it. Make sure we get it there. Put. Yeah, oh, buddy. Thank you. Easy. Four for five. Yeah. You normally don't say it going up. <laughs> yeah. but, mm -hmm. Good but you say it there. A little bogey there. This is what it is though. Come on, par five next. Five. All right, four for five as well, baby. Four for five for five. <laughs>
All right, y'all, coming up to hole two of this video, we have a 567-yard par five. There's a lot of bunkers on this hole. There's not that much rough unless you go way right or way left. Well, actually, the fairway looks pretty tight from up here, but I think the bunkers are gonna be causing more mayhem than anything, and yeah, we're just gonna get to it. Par five, that means you gotta hit two full swings, which really brings the rough and the bunkers into play. Let's get to it and see what happens. Oh, yes. All right, I'll tell you one thing, though, that my strategy, I'm gonna swing nice and easy at this. Bunker. Nice. Uh oh. Nope. Bunker. Nope, that's perfect. Just gonna perfect. be short of it. Might be in the fescue. Is it there? Oh, just kidding. Perfect. It's gonna be short How of the bunker. He, he, that piece of fairway is this big he just aimed at. <laughs> Alright, just hitting a normal driver here. Ball. Great ball, Luke. Did you hit that ball so. Hold on. That's good. Mm -hmm. It's got to be Perry. What do you mean? He's right of the bunker. Yeah, good. good. Perfect. Whew. Need that. I don't have a tee. I just need a driver. Oh. Well, oh, sure. Oh. Dude. Dang. Oh, yes. All right, fairway. Jeez. Thank goodness. Oh, wait. <laughs> there goes my it tracer. Went in, it went into the bunker. Literally the best oh, tracer dude. of Matt's life. That's right. It did go in the bunker though. It'll be alright. Boys, I'm just trying to hit grass. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the rough one. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> oh no, he's gonna have to drop in the rough. That's a two-shotter. That's a two-shotter right off the bat right there, boys. Sit down. Carry it and sit. Carry it and sit. It'll sit. I'm worried about. Yeah, I'm worried about. Rough. Oh, it did carry. You guys might be wondering what is Steven doing in the other fairway. The thing is, if he dropped where his ball crossed, he has to drop in the rough. So instead, he's going to the point where it crossed through the pin and then direct line back. Thankfully, he's able to get to the other fairway and take a drop. So it's only a one shotter instead of a two shotter. He's all the way over in the other fairway. I respect it. This is exactly what I would do as well. Where are you going? Oh my oh, gosh. Through the tree. You're good. It's That's phenomenal. <laughs> that is phen he went right through that tree. Now he's playing his fourth shot up there instead of all the way back here. That's impressive. We are just out of the rough here. We stayed short of this bunker. 225 to the pin. 190 to carry the front edge. I'm gonna go with a four iron. No! Oh, boys, well, that flew on me. Well, I just gotta pray that that did not roll down into the rough, but if it did, we'll have to take a penalty. All right, all right, all right, yo. I got 220 yards left to this pin. I got 194 to carry that bunker. Straight downwind. I'm gonna hit a seven iron. I feel comfortable with this club. Yeah, let's hope it goes that, that direction. That's all I'm thinking. Wow. Go, go, go. I thinned it a bit. I thinned it a bit. Go. I just thinned that there. Yeah, I'm hitting seven as well. Oh my gosh, bro. Thin seven iron. Got a putt for eagle. No rough for bunkers on this hole. Got seven iron as well. Same idea, just trying to work a draw into that pin. Hopefully give myself a look at Eagle. Come on, let's go. What am I doing, Colin? Yeah. We got 213 actual, down to like 206, downwind. I'm gonna hit a seven iron, but I'm just gonna take a nice aggressive line. Kinda make things a little interesting. <laughs> Nice. That's tough. I think six iron is actually a tad bit too much. So I'm going to actually hit a beautiful pure seven iron like I did on that par three that put me in the water. Hopefully I can put this one on the green. Man, that was so clean, Luis. 
Boys, it's been a rough one today. I got 150, probably playing about 145. I got a 50 degree. I'm just trying to hit the green. That's the only goal. Steve? All right, here we go. We gotta make that putt, stay at par. We're good, guys. The fairway kind of extends back here. We got a tricky up and down, but let's see. Up and down to get to two under. Oh. <laughs> I thought that was it, guys. I really did. Wow. A little short of the green, honestly. I don't normally do this, but I'm going for the bump and run. Up the left side. Just trying to trickle this one onto the green, hopefully let it run to the hole. Crafty little shot by Clark. Gonna give him, an, I think, a pretty solid birdie look there. And I can also give myself a good birdie look. Not the simplest eagle chip, but just put it on the green, give myself a birdie look. That's all I can ask for, and hopefully sink it. All right, Colin, we've got a pretty straightforward chip shot here. Not really much to it. I think it's just a little bit downhill, a little left to right. Nice shot, Dude. Luke. I tried. I tried. I wanted those extra points. For my par, I had to take. I had to take a stroke. It is what it is. Set, just set, just set, just set. Oh! No. Well, made a bo bogey correct with the stroke. Two over. That's not what you want to see. Bobby. Here we go, Colin. I gotta make this birdie happen inside. Let's make this birdie. Moving a little left to right. Oh. You still I got it. Gonna See, it <laughs> sometimes you look up into the sky and the rain trickles in. Here we go, guys. Just to get to two under. Oh, oh in the I got it was just a little fast down that hill, but oh. In for par. That's unfortunate there. Dang it, guys. Needed that. All right, y'all. I got a bit of work to clean up here for my birdie. Just saw Grant's back of the cup. Let's knock it in. I missed that. <sighs> Me and Steve on that train today. That was unfortunate. You hate to miss four footers, especially for birdie. And uh, each stroke costs you a lot out here in the Good Good Cup. Tension's running high for me and Steve. We're both sucking the hind. We're coming up the rear, that's for sure. But hey, I'm one over, Steve's two over. Luke made birdie there. That was a solid birdie. Luke's currently one under as well as Grant. Par four straight away. Obviously, gotta hit the fairway here. Dude. I am on one today. I am on one. Good ball. Grant. I get lucky. What that is. Yep. Where'd that go? Bungy? There we go. Yeah, that's short, I think. Holy pure. Set. <laughs> or carry it. Carry it. Just get over it. Get over it. Yes! Did you get over it? No. Short. I said I did see it bounce, so could maybe still be short. All right, Garrett. Uh, I think that short? one's short. Probably short. That's definitely not getting there. That's good, Bobby. Got that keep up. Yeah. Is that alright? Yes. Hey. That a boy, Steve. That's all I needed. Right there. See one of them. Make contact. Alright, I gotta make something happen. No, I've petted some weird animals. Anyways, 180. I gotta hit a 7 iron. Yeah, that's an old. Alright, post shot interview. What's the weirdest animal you've ever petted? 
Uh, the capybara. What's the capybara? It's the biggest rodent in the world. That mother, mother trucker had teeth like, and I literally just stroked him. He started purring. Like I've never heard an animal purr, but that thing goes. Mm. <laughs> we stayed way back from this bunker. We got about 155, 160 to the pin. Gonna hit a seven iron. Just going for the center of the green. It's protected by a bunch of bunkers, so. Oh, he's good. Thank you. All right, y'all, I still got 153 yards after the pin. I got lucky, stayed short of the bunker. Let's see if we can hit a good shot here and just two putt, a golf hole, please. Go pitching ones as well, Bobby. Go, go. All right, I got a pitching wedge as well, just inside of Bubby here. Also got very lucky. I'm literally a yard from the from the rough. It's give and take, you know? Golf's one of those things. You get lucky and you get really unlucky. I got my fair share of both today, but I got to take advantage and, and hold this out or something crazy. Yikes. Grass in the bunk. Well, I unfortunately did not get lucky here, Colin, so. Now I really gotta make something happen. I got nine irons, 137. I try and put it back there and get up and down for par. Down, baby. Sharp. Please. Oh! Did I drive in front of that? No. Wow! Now I can make a par and not be out of this thing. Come on, Matt. All right, Luis, we got 128 flag, a little uphill, probably like 130, 31, a little into the wind. She's gonna feel one in there. Flag's a little bit on the left side there. Oh, hang on. Hang on. I'm assuming it's probably green. Overcooked that thing a little bit. Thing was sitting in the microwave for a little too long. All right, y'all, I'm not even gonna line this one up. I'm so far out here. I see it doing a pretty good bit of right to left, especially at the end. All about speed. Let's see if we can two putt this one. I've three putt enough times today. Just, let's lag it up there and tap it in. Oh. I didn't know there was a false side here. And uh, I gotta add a stroke to my score. So I gotta chip in for par here now. Nice shot, Luke. I made it on the green, which is crazy. I'm excited for that. Definitely really, really happy about that. Kind of a tough putt down the hill here. No way, Mark. Oh! Yes. Oh, Steve! Yes. Ooh. Oh! Good punch. Ah! Here we go, guys. This is to get to two under for the birdie. Come on. This would be huge. Oh! Nice putt, right Thank you. Not a good putt to be hesitant on because I'm not really sure which way this is going. But. I'm just gonna play it straight and hope it stays straight. Mm -hmm. That's a double for me. All right, y'all, I'm, I'm seeing this one. Back of the cup. Let's put a good roll on it. See it go in the hole. Dude, today's just been that day, bro. All right, I'm gonna try and make this for part pump. What an up and down, Sharf. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. What a hole to finish on, guys. There's actually quite a bit of rough here. Things can go either way. I mean, if you hit it. Wow. Yeah, there's a lot that can go on here. I'm going to hit an eight iron. Current scores are I'm two under, Matt is even. Juan is one over, and then from there on out, I have zero clue. I'm one over. Uh, we are on to a par three. 171 yards. Me and Steve just going for the hole in one. Go. Go. Oh, barely. You hit it a little thin. Super lucky on that one. Okay. Dude, that was a game changer right there. If that went in the rough, things could have got really interesting. Mm 
catch it. Oh, Could he play it if it's sitting on top of the moss and it's not in the bunker? Is it? Yeah. Technically, that one would be rough if he could play it out of the water, yeah. That's true. We just said it was hazard. <laughs> and then when you drop in the, the rough. All right, I got a nine iron here. All right, Steve. Hole in one. Oh, yeah. That's in the rough. I hit two inches behind that, Steve. Oh, yes. All right, y'all. That was nice. That lightens the mood some. We're all playing bad down here at the bottom of the pack. I've also felt the same as Steve. I'm frustrated missing all those putts, but hole in one here. I got a pee wedge. I'm gonna hit it before the wind picks up. Oh, just stay in the short stuff, please. I'm gonna putt that ball. You have no idea. Oh yeah. Oh, you're inside of me. Oh, how about now? Yeah, I, I'm putting it. I would've put that if it was plugged in the side of the hill. <laughs> I'm not putting the, I can't putt either. It doesn't matter what I do. Well, now oh, that's just in. The ball. I actually think I could. I think it's your only shot, soldier. Yeah, I think I can hit this. Dude, Colin, I think I can hit this. I don't have to get wet either. I think if you're gonna hit it, because if you hit it with the bounce, it catches the surface tension of the water and skins instead of going down and getting to the ball. What are you at? One over. What are you at? I'm at even. What are you, what's Grant at? Grant's at 200. Okay, so, okay, Grant doesn't matter. No, I'm worried about getting second right now. Matt, I'll go real quick. You want me to go? All right, here we go, just short of the green. Sharp is kind of lining up a shot. I'm gonna go here, I'm a little outside of him. It's a weird flop shot, but we're gonna go for it. Quan, what are the chances of hitting this? Honestly, not bad. Yeah, I mean, part of the ball is like a little bit above the water. A little dim. I mean, I'm be honest with you. I always see your greatest par of all time posted. You have an opportunity to make another one. Because this isn't a stroke, is it? If I no, play no. this, no. So this is my mm -hmm. second shot. We only said bunkers are rough. So you'd be hitting Can two I lose from your here. Glove? Oh, say, say. No. Oh. <laughs> that was honestly so impressive. Dude, Dude, that was such a good try by Sharf, but you have to laugh. Dude, he is soaked. That just came out like a rocket, bro. <laughs> Up and down for the par. I'm just going for the fun of it. You know what, boys? Oh. All right, y'all. I'm just gonna try and put this up there close. Just do me good. Do me good. I'll take that. I will take that. I'm very pleased with that. All right, Luis. We got a long putt up here, up the hill, a little left to right. It's gonna be hard to get the speed right, but try to make par here. I am definitely out here. I need this for par to stay at one over. Oh! Let's just uh, stay at two under, guys. This would be a nice confidence boost. Dang it. We've been struggling on the greens today. If we can make this, that'd be big. I think they would put me in because I've gone bogey par, bogey. So this is for two over. This is actually important right here. There's some points on the line. Hey, hey, hey. That uh, one, that goes in. The two footer and the three footer, I can't make. Let's turn this sloppy Joe into a mud bucket. Oh, I pushed it. Ah, that puts me at three over. I got my par putt here, but it's not a, it's not a gimme by any means. It's, it's on the edge. We're only a three footer. Alrighty. 
That's a par for me. I finish at one over. Alrighty guys, well that wraps it up. I mean, that was super competitive. It's getting crazy out here. I can feel the tension in the air. I'm just saying, it's because every video matters so much. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this. I mean, I gained a little bit on Luke there. I know that. You did. So here, we're gonna go over the points again real quick, y'all. Before we finish out this video, thank you guys again for watching. So this is how the rough is lava worked. You got first place. Yep. So Grant got 240 points. You got second place. You got 190 points. Garrett and I, tied for third place so we're going to add up third place and fourth place points which is 130 plus 80 equals 210 just like they do the money on the pro pro tours yeah, yeah. you add it up you divide it by two so 210 divided by two me and garrett both got 105 points matt was 60 points in fifth place and steve got 20 points in sixth place so the updated score totals are so 1685